Yes, yes, yes. It's Raphael Dawkins Combat Radio. And once again, we are on the move. The sun is blazing down. It is beautiful. Beautiful time, beautiful sight. It's shorts and vest weather. Shorts and vest weather over here in the UK. Okay. Let me see. Is this thing straightened up? Is this thing lined up okay? Yeah, it looks okay. Looks okay. Looks okay. Right, let's get into it. So, we're talking about anybody who tuned into the, uh, the live podcast last night will recall or remember we talked about we were talking about one of the subjects one of the topics was showtimes showtimes deal with Deontay the bronze bomber wilder so and we were looking at the numbers I was looking at the numbers and to me the numbers don't make sense Wilder's highest purse from Showtime, recorded, reported purse from Showtime, was $2.1 million. And that came about via the fight with Luis Ortiz. That's $2.1 million. Now, that had a viewership of 1.1 million viewers. So, remember those numbers, $2.1 million purse and 1.1 million viewers. Okay, now, it's been reported in BoxingScene.com that Wilder received a purse of $10 million, between nine and $10 million. Those are the reported figures. Okay, however, the viewership for that fight was 900,000 900,000 remember his previous high was with Tito, with Luis Ortiz of 1.1 million so what does that mean that means that Wilder is being paid five times five times what he was usually earning or his previous high five times his previous high but his returning figures lower than his standard 1.1 or 1 million reporting figures of less than his 1.1 million for Luis Ortiz and in other fights I believe he has hit that 1 million viewership mark so the question is the question is is Wilder worth or is it will, will it be sustainable will the purse will the purses of 5 times his previous high will will those purses be sustainable will he be able to sustain or will Showtime be able to sustain that level of purse purses that payment a level of payment will they be able to sustain that while it seems that Wilder's name value or perceived name value is not being reflected in his viewership rates remember the reason why the reason why Showtime were prompted to raise significantly raise their purses to Wilder the reason they were prompted to do that was because Wilder was offered 20 million by dance or the zone excuse me so Wilder being offered 20 million by the zone has prompted Showtime to increase his purses. Look at this M. Uh, look at this guy in front of me. Doesn't know where he's going. I wish I'd have chose the next lane, but anyway, yeah, it looks confused. Damn it! I gotta be 
I gotta be where I gotta be. Right, my next appointment, which is at the garages. Right, so, 20 million was what he was offered by dance. 10 million is what he, offered, what, what, what he accepted from Showtime. So that means he took half, but it's a three fight deal minimum. Probably, it will probably be a rolling deal, but for sure we know right now it's a three. Oh shit, this guy's freaking out in that Merc. He's freaking out. His wheel spinning. The old man don't know what he's doing. This is scary shit. You could have caught him reversing live. Live on, live on camera. That would be good for my insurance, but anyway. Dude's freaking out. He don't know what he's doing. This is scary. I should change lanes. But then I got the jack to my left. This is madness. It's madness being caught. Look at him. Look at him. He don't know what to do. It, it, it. Oh my lord. Listen. I don't want to catch a live crash. I don't want it. I'm in a rush. I'm busy today. I ain't got time for this. So, back on topic. Back on topic. Can Showtime. Yeah, go on. Race through the lights, mate. Can Showtime sustain the level of payment that they're offering to I better stay back from this guy because he's crazy this old man's crazy you don't know what he's doing can Showtime sustain the payments five times their highest payments to Wilder can they sustain those 10 million dollar payments when the return is only the same as what it used to be Oh my lord, are you catching this? Can you see this? Can you see this guy hopping and jumping? Oh lord, I need to back up from this guy. I am legit concerned that this guy is gonna put it in reverse and just speed backwards. I am concerned. I don't know if he's taking this thing for a test drive or what, but he don't know, seem to know what gear he's in. This is scary stuff being captured. He just watched his screen, I don't even think he meant to. Back to on topic, can Showtime, how long can Showtime sustain these payments? Five times high, oh, here we go. Five times higher than their standard payments to him. How long they can they sustain that when they're only getting the same return? Will, will Deontay Wilder's payments from Showtime eventually bankrupt them? That is the question. Our Showtime gonna go bankrupt due to these payments trying to compete with the zone and yet Wilder is not bringing in the viewership they had expected Wilder's viewership is not matching the hype the viewership figures are not matching the hype where do Showtime go from here how long can they sustain these unsustainable payments is the question okay and with my heart in my throat from that Merc driver who's just gone it's Raphael Dawkins how long we been on yeah Raphael Dawkins combat radio like subscribe comment and share and uh, if you have not checked out the live shows please feel free to go ahead and do so very enjoyable highly entertaining i must say so we may as well muse on this for a little bit longer let me fucking swing around can i do it 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 yes i can uh right so yeah that's the question man they're paying the guy five times more than they used to pay him and yet he's only giving a similar return no improvement on the return no improvement on the return you know so how long can they sustain these payments how long can they keep on giving him 10 mil and him just giving them the same return back what's happening with the shortfall what is happening with the shortfall? It's madness, I tell you, madness. I hope 
Showtime haven't bit enough more than they can chew with this deal. I sincerely hope not, because it would be a very sad day in boxing if they went under because they tried to compete with the zone and failed. And Wilder himself, he, how, how, how will he feel long, long term down the line when he knows that he took his 10 million shout? 10 million shout. How is he going to feel? How is he going to feel? You know, mad, 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 mad times. Mad things, mad times. So, I've hit the garage, my destination. Gonna drop this baby off, go about my day, just down the road, and we, I will see y'all, speak to y'all later in the next installment, okay? It's Raphael Dawkins. Like, subscribe, comment, and for sure, share. I'm out.